you know, this might feed really easily, really well into the question of why teams are tending to shift left instead of right or or never really think of it. Is that review techniques? If No, I don't know if I understand the question perfectly, but review to me means reviewing a test plan, reviewing code that's checked in. Bettina mm -hmm. can maybe say in the chat whether or not I'm, I'm right about that. But um, you're all on the same team when you're shifting left. What you're doing is is that as an SDET, you are working with developers, feature developers, to build testing earlier into the product, into the process. So a review is the same thing as a review it is now. So if you're reviewing code, you're gonna be reviewing integration testing code. You'll be reviewing UI code. You'll be reviewing maybe unit testing code, maybe feature development code. They'll be helping you review test plans. When you're shifting right, you know, the entire data science BI team, like to me, all of that is necessarily involved. It's going to be the, the ops team, the people involved with monitoring. It's a whole other business unit in, in a lot of cases. It's a whole other vice president, probably. Hmm. And the culture is different. The language is different. Unless you're doing a straight up SRE implementation, um, you're probably you probably just have such different contexts you almost don't even know how to speak the same language so the review is going to be using you know human language to describe the kinds of problems you're trying to solve before you can even look at code together because you're not using the same kind of code you're not using the same kinds of questions or anything like that so it's much more difficult and much more uh you you have to be a lot more collaborative and thoughtful about how you approach these projects they're probably a lot more time consuming and a lot more expensive at first Mm -hmm. until you start to get some really good feedback from the process. So shifting left is much easier in that regard. That's a great point to bring up. I'd like to know more about <clears throat> what kind of review techniques happen in towards the um, post-release. If, if anyone's got any uh, anything they can add to that, then definitely head over to the club.ministryoftesting.com and add your thoughts and your contributions in there because I'd like to know more about that myself. So thank you yeah. for that question, Bettina. I'd like to find uh, out more, do people review the analytics events as a team before or after the release? Do you go through the kinds of signals that are being sent? I'd love to hear about the stories about that. We did that, but still we were, you know, we, we always felt like we were behind in that regard.